Hello everyone, welcome to the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. In the previous tutorial, we have created SQL to get related post data to show below the post here. So now we need to create our Ajax call which will render that data like this. First of all, we need to inspect element to fetch the HTML. So here is the blog item, one blog item. We have to copy the HTML of this blog item. So here we have columns and here we have the rows. We simply copy from this. So let's copy this and we have to paste in the layout of front end. So to render the data properly, we can give it an ID such as related. So now it is prominent for jQuery that this ID is used for the front and related post purpose. Now go on the top. Here we will create a Ajax call. Let's copy the previous Ajax call, paste that here, and now we have to send the message to post controller, and action will be related. It fetch the related record. Type of get, we don't need this. Now we need to paste that HTML which we have copied here, and we have to uh, store that in a variable. Oops, uh, like this, okay. Now we need to make it clean. After uh, making a whole string, we can easily render this uh, below the post. Here and now you use. this and we are almost done with this okay so it is perfect now what we need to do we need to render this uh, within the related so what we will do we will say hash related dot append this text but before append we will empty that okay and that's 
it now then we will refresh the page it will get empty but not render with a new record because we did not uh, created the action listener okay so we need to create that but first <coughs> Here you can see uh, it is also not uh, removed because the Ajax is stopped here and the code for empty is represented here. So in the next tutorial we will create the related action and render the code in the front end. I hope this is informative if you have any kind of question you can ask us. Don't forget to subscribe the Engineering Projects YouTube channel. Take care. Bye-bye. Have fun.